in the period following a high holy day, Christmas and Easter. It is common for many to fall back and stop practicing their faithfulness for a few days. I've noticed that in the years that I've been doing this, that the Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, following Easter, no one watches, listens the scriptures. And unfortunately, some of these are the most beautiful works. And the writing of the lessons, these lessons, are great. What I've found and what others have written and I've put together, whatever. I mean, it's not my work, it's the work of others. And I've just plopped it on the page. So today is mine, but it is very short. It is a lesson for reflection and meditation, as is tomorrow's. It is on service and love. The Lord showed his love through his service. He declared, the last shall be made first, and the first last. For when you do as I do, then you show your love. And that was the gospel on Monday, Thursday, Holy Thursday last week. Thus, how may you show your love to another Christian? Through acts of service, not through empty words or declarations or silly shows of affection, you know, sky writing or whatever. Show your love in a lasting manner. Do something for them. The Lord was servant to all of his apostles because he was the last but the first. He washed their feet to cleanse them of the dust of their journey. Within your life, find ways to serve those you love. It does not have to be washing their feet. But it could be washing someone's car, washing their windows, that would be a very lasting show of love. Because then they can see you. You could wash the windows and then garden so they could see the beautiful flowers rather than the weeds. There are many, many things you can do. If they own a house, you can build something for them. You can fix things for them if you're in the least way handy. If you're not, contact me. I'll teach you how to do things. I used to do construction, guys. But always... Always do something that is lasting, not something that will be gone 
in 15 minutes. Not something that will be consumed and, and just disappear. Make it an experience. Make it a process. Do something.